the worst part is when you start having feelings for a woman when you start wanting a woman she can be one of the biggest distractions to why a lot of men out here cannot reach their purpose whatsoever most of the females that are out here you're not going to be able to spend let's say in one month a thousand dollars and you're going to end up doubling your money never the way money can start rolling in that's the way women will start rolling in <laughs> baddies and my bad men fellas it is your girl Bosana and welcome be boss army so as you guys can tell by the title today we are going to be talking about how to get on your purpose for her to want you so pretty much i'm going to tell you guys some things that all revolve around you things that you need to do especially for this new year and it's going to basically attract more women into your life have that woman that maybe you still are wanting and not leaving back in 2020 actually want you now okay so i have three major tips for you guys and the last important one is going to be at the end and so make sure you guys watch until the end to get everything but if you are new then you need to go ahead follow my social media make sure you check out my patreon and of course make sure you're subscribed with that post notification and last thing of course go ahead and make sure you are subscribed to my second youtube channel so let's go ahead and get started so the first point that i have written down is that being stingy with your time and you must value your time so going into the new year a lot of guys out here have wasted a lot of time and so have we women too but what's happening is that a lot of guys are so available for women girls are the ones that ask and make the plans as they feel when they feel and guys are the ones that are more available so you being on your purpose realistically you don't have time for women at all because you're you should be i was gonna say clearly but you know honestly clearly you should be really focused on your goals your dreams figuring out what it is that you are so good at or what it is that you should be doing and following and just chasing after and of course that is strictly something that is your purpose not someone else not another woman so what's happening is that guys they start thinking like okay you know what this could be my future this could be my wife this could be a girl that i get somewhere with and so let me give her some time of the day when you are on your purpose and you want a woman to give you attention, want a woman to notice you, how can she notice you when you are always available or even just available here and there when she needs you, when she wants to see you, right? So you have to take it as in not only being stingy with your time, but it's like be careful and mindful who you hand it out to because not only is it going to be somebody you want, but you following your purpose there's going to be so many people that are going to try to push you away from you getting closer to your purpose. And that's the thing about life. Not just speaking about women, but just generally speaking, there's always distraction out here. And the worst part is when you start having feelings for a woman, when you start wanting a woman, she can be one of the biggest distractions to why a lot of men out here cannot reach their purpose whatsoever. And, you know, look, look at 2020. Reflect back and see what it was that was stopping you from reaching all your goals, reaching all your success, right? And remember, not only do girls love to be noticed and all that stuff, but they try to get as much as they can out of you because they have to for their ego. And you have to look at it as like, that's what boosts them up. That's what lifts them up. So if a woman that sees that you are into her, even if she didn't really want you, Sometimes just because of the fact that they see that you are so busy, that you are on your purpose, they start noticing you even more. And it's so strange how it works, but that's how it works. She she starts noticing you even more. And it's really because of the thought of where is he at, right? What is he doing? Oh, he's so busy. And also, remember what you've been doing before, they get used to it. You know, they get accustomed to that lifestyle with you. Oh, he's going to hit me up this day. He's going to hit me up this many times. They are already used to that drill. And that's a big key thing that I'll finish off before going on to the last thing. You have to switch it up on women. Most importantly, go ahead and follow your dreams. Be focused and get all in tune with all that you need to be doing so things can align. But of course, of course, you guys, you guys, let the woman be pushed aside and let them figure out what's going on 
not only with you but maybe their own personal issues a lot of girls because of the fact that they have men out here that give them the time of the day that you know are always available they can't even worry about themselves i'm not saying that's the solution for a lot of girls that are for the streets and all that but i'm definitely trying to say that girls can cover up so much more with guys helping them and you know some as you guys may watch this video you guys may not know some of this stuff of course make sure you guys are stingy with your time be treating it like it's very very valuable and remember every second does count and only give her a certain amount and that's after after she deserves it after she actually tried to get your time and yes she has to try it's not just okay first time i talked to her second time no it's none of that okay all right so let's move on to the next thing on my list and this is change your mindset to it's a privilege to spend money on her and stack your bread stack your money so you trying to be on your purpose how are you gonna be on your purpose with what you can use to invest or empower yourself or get closer to your purpose reaching your goals is being spread out or being spread out to somebody or being used on somebody that you can never ever receive from again or never will ever you know find beneficial things for the reason of spending that money so back to what i would always say men investing money into women that's the worst investment you can ever make because you will never ever get your money back right of course when i say yes when you find that rare bunch when you find a woman that can pick you up and please fellas there is women out here that have done that with men. There's guys out here that are bigger, you know, famous guys have talked about how their women are the reason why they're doing great. You know, the women lift them up, right? Or help them flip things. So it's possible. But most of the females that are out here, you're not going to be able to spend, let's say in one month, a thousand dollars and you're going to end up doubling your money. Never. With most women out here, you're going to mine it so much and it's just like, where did your money go, right? And you guys are trying to be on your purpose and it's becoming falsely, falsely claimed. You guys are literally saying you are on your purpose. You guys are trying to act like you're on your, on your purpose, but realistically, you're not. I just want you guys to realize this because sometimes you have to hear the truth, right? And that's the same thing with a lot of guys out here that want to say they're alpha males, Oh, they're this and that, but you guys crack. You guys fall into all the traps when it comes down to women when you're talking to her. So how can you really be alpha male? So it's the same thing with women when it comes down to investing, giving giving them your time. All of these things all play a part to who you are and how much are you really about yourself? How much are you really on your purpose? And a lot of guys out here struggle to figure out, oh, how do I get on my purpose? Or first things first is take the woman out of your life. Stop wasting so much time and money on her. So stacking your bread, trying to get on your purpose, not only do women want money from men, but now it's like you're switching everything because yeah, time is big. But when money doesn't roll in, a lot of women won't stick around at all, right? And what happens is when you take that and flip it and become better because you're on your purpose and you're reaching your goals, that's when she's going to 10 times notice you even more. And she, when she when she notices you, not only do you have way more money that you had before when she knew you, but now you already built everything that you need to or you're close to your purpose. Now you have a higher status or have a good, good status. Whatever it is, you definitely improved in all the things around you. And so with you guys saving your money, stacking your bread, it brings so many other blessings into your life. It brings so many opportunities and it allows you to get closer to reaching your purpose or at least trying to figure it out, trying to figure out the next steps. So take it as in women are very distracting and you're also losing. They're very distracting when it comes down to your time. That's why men cannot get on their purpose so distracted can't even figure out how to get on their purpose because how can you when you spend so much time with that woman and then on top of that you're losing money so you can't even make things happen you can't get to a certain place right and so the last thing i'll say about the two things i've already said before i move on to the last thing is that all these things if you guys just realize this is the reason why guys are so stuck these are things that are playing a big part and i hope it stays in 2020 but it's playing a big part to why a lot, a lot of men out here cannot pass a certain level. And they'll never understand what's on the other side. And that's how a lot of guys became that are actually alpha. They understood all this and they were able to go on to the other side. And it's really about sacrificing and understanding that there's better things out here. There's more valuable things out here. And it all starts with you, what you need, what you want for yourself. Of course,
course your purpose right so when you guys start realizing that and what's really important out here you will start seeing how much the woman's a waste of time and then when you actually make all that happen and getting on your purpose then you'll just see how easy it was the whole time to have these women be mooching on to you to have her want you badly it really starts with eliminating her out because that's the easier way to go about it but i know that can be so challenging so you know, that's why I give you guys tips. You can start with these little things and then follow it. And then the next thing you know, it's becoming it's so easy. The next thing you know, you don't even know this girl anymore. And yet she's hitting you on a private account, right? Trying to see what's up, you know, making a fake account, trying to see if you'll cave in, trying to make you become a simp again, you know, things like that. That's what it actually comes down to in this real life world. But sometimes you won't ever understand it until you really exclude her out, forget about her or at least take these tips that I give you guys, okay? So let's move on to the last thing on my list, and this is be full on out, focus on elevating. So first things first, you getting on your purpose, it's not always about where you start. Honestly, guys, it's not even about where you start. But wherever you're at right now, the way you're supposed to look at it with trying to elevate and get to exactly where you need to be, you have to take it as in you're, you're here and it's the next steps constantly. All right, so there's people out here that are so successful already and what they're doing is not getting stuck on the little bit of success that they're, they're, they already did. Not the little bit of money that they just won, right? Not the little flip that they just did. They take that and that's light to them. You know, they don't think so highly of it and they're onto the next thing. Thinking bigger, thinking greater. So, you know, fellas out here that are already having issues with women, it's so discouraging already, right? So it's just like, first things first, avoid that. Don't even pay attention to women. Don't get so stressed on where you're at because how many alphas out here do you think really started as sim? So many of them, I can maybe, I don't even know the numbers, but I can definitely say a lot. So there's so many guys that have to figure it out. There's so many guys that have to get broken by a woman. There's so many guys that were probably homeless. There's so many guys that didn't have nothing and it's literally so incredible how much they got to that point but do you guys really think that those guys that are at, that were at that point you know at the bottom doing the worst heartbroken do you think they were so stuck on where they're at or they said what's my next step and actually went to do that and then after they got that done what's my next step what's my next step and it was constantly what's my next step and then getting it and making it happen that's what it is. So, you guys, it's all about always elevating and going up. Never just get comfortable. Never just get stuck at where you're at because it's going to keep you where you're at, right? And, of course, you'll never leave your comfort zone. Absolutely not. You will never, ever, ever be able to go to the top of the stairs if you want to be stuck on the first stairs by all the other stuff that's distracting you, by all the other women and one man could be that one specific woman that is literally just keeping you right where they're at. Nobody wants to see you figure out how to walk up those stairs. No, no, nobody does. They don't want to show you how to do it quickly or how, what's the next step. You don't get a jump step. You don't get all this stuff. No, it's on you. So make it happen. Okay, you guys. So understand once you start doing all these things, the way money can start rolling in, that's the way women will start rolling in. And especially that woman that you want will start rolling in once that happens. Please just take it like this. A woman that wants you or you want more attention from women, it all starts with giving yourself more attention first. So I really hope this video helped you guys out. And make sure you comment down below the type of videos you'd like to see. Make sure you give me a big thumbs up for a quicker video to come up. Make sure you check out my Patreon. Make sure you check out my social media. And of course, make sure you check out my second YouTube channel. You'll see me in my next video. Bye, guys.